Hola mis amigos and possible amigas, my name is Taffrey16 and welcome back to another reaction video. Today, we're going to be reacting to Alan Partridge on Comic Relief in 1995. This was a sketch somebody had linked me. Uh, I think it's just him doing interviews, which more than likely go wrong because it's Alan Partridge. Uh, I was actually able to find, sh shout out to uh, Couch Tipper on YouTube. He HD upscaled this. And uploaded it about a year ago. He's actually HD upscaled a bunch of stuff. Uh, so I will leave a link in the video description to his channel. Um, because I, I guess he did this himself. So I mean that's. And he, you're about to see it. Did a damn fine job. It looks incredible. Uh, this is only about seven minutes. So let's go ahead and watch it. Oh boy. Hi, I'm Adam Partridge. And I'm, I'm speaking. Sorry, I can do this without the nose. It's, it's difficult. I'm speaking <laughs> to you live from Norwich Park, one of the top five municipal parks in the country. Say hooray! Hooray! Hooray. Uh, not quite the turnout we would have uh, wanted. My uh, whereabouts today was supposed to have been advertised in a two-pronged campaign jointly on teletext and the local press, neither of which has happened. Um, inevitably, there will be repercussions. But I'm not here to today to talk about repercussions, um, or indeed bad internal administration, which will inevitably be at the bottom of this. <laughs> I'm here to talk about comic relief. Say hooray! Hooray! So if you want to come down here and swell the numbers, please do. As at the moment, this is really quite poor. It is very poor. Now, let's ask a question of uh, some a young lady. What's your name? Gloria. Gloria. Have you raised any money for comic relief? No. Right. That's, that's all right. Anyone else? No? No one else? Well, I'm sure when the people come down here, there's going to be some great stories about the mad things people have done to raise money. Of course. I'll, I'll think of one. I will. Um, well, last month, I adopted something you could do. I adopted an African daughter called Shia. Um, I say adopted, I don't have her in the house. Um, that would be just insane, impractical. I mean, Carol gets up in the morning, she's off to fitness. I've got various uh, projects to do. Right. To. Some of them are right. quite exciting, actually. Can't say too much at the moment, but... Uh, Keep your eye out in the autumn for a travel program. Oh no, travel. not the travel I'll program. Um, anyway, the, po the point is, it costs me no more than fifty pounds a year to maintain the welfare of that daughter. Less than a pound a week. Not bad for a daughter, my daughter. Um, right, good. Back to the studio. Say hooray! Hooray! From Norwich. Oh, I don't want to go. Hooray! Hey! Got a cavity. Breath smells awful. I'm Alan Partridge! Hooray! I'm Hooray! Alan Partridge. Hooray! I'm Alan Partridge! Hooray! Hooray. 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 Don't say it anymore. I'm Alan Partridge. Hooray. Oh, Christ. <laughs> We're here live in Norwich Park, where people are doing all kinds of tomfoolery to raise money for comic relief. Most recently are the lads from the Chroma Tire Exhaust and Clutch Centre, who have been doing a sponsored bungee jump. And here to tell me all about that is their wow. managing director. Please welcome Mr. Nick Pellet, who is the MD of Chroma Tire Exhaust and Clutch Centre. Hooray. Nick, hello. Hello, Alan. Enjoy your bungee jumping? Uh, I was there, but I wasn't doing the jumping. Well, what, skiving off? <coughs> no, I've got arthritis. OK, ah. that's, nothing wrong with that. Fair enough. Um, as long as you can still write the cheque, your hand's not too shaky. Uh, no, that's Parkinson's, isn't it? Um, anyway, <laughs> um, you have the lads from, got to say the name of the company one more time, uh, the lads from the Chroma Tire Exhaust and Clutch Centre are going to present us now with a cheque. For the value of seventy-five pounds, seventy-five pounds. Yeah, I don't believe it. You are Chroma's. I'm not going to say your name again. We agreed to say it three times. You are the biggest manufacturer of tire exhaust and clutches in the Chroma area. I mean, that, I mean that's virtually your name. I've said it again. And you've just got twenty thousand pounds of free advertising for seventy-five quid. Twenty thousand pounds? How do you want that? Sod your money. Just so, so, rip this up. I'm going to rip this up. It's cardboard. Yeah, you, it's cardboard. You, yeah, <laughs> take that over by those bins and, and tear it up. Burn it or something. Burn um, it. Right, well, I'm sorry, ladies and gentlemen, to counteract the benefit that he may have uh, received from uh, his free advertising, I'm going to diss his company live on air. <laughs> I, know, I know this company. You're not going to say the name again. I took my Rover Sterling there. It's a new one in bronze, tan upholstery. I took it there to have the exhaust replaced three times. Each time it broke when I had it, I brought it back. That's the level of service. I tell you, if I'd had that exhaust on me, I would have shoved it up your nose. <laughs> Back to the studio. No, I'm told we've got another minute. Uh, all right. Um, Nick, do you drive? Yeah. Automatic? Yes, it is. Yeah, well, you don't want to be working the clutch with your arthritic leg. So I don't, I don't suffer from it myself, arthritis. 
But uh, my brother-in-law does, and my God, he lets you know about it. You know, if, it's, if he's not going on about his sodding binoculars, it's his plumbing leg. Oh, really and that's cold in the background. Hooray! Hooray! Oh! What happened? I'm Alan Partridge, and as you can see, I've been a victim of the Swaffham Fiverside Custard Pie Hit Ooh, Squad, who raised four thousand pounds. No, not a. You've done it once. Don't do it again. Oh, oh we got him. Oh, oh. stupid. It's all right. Oh, what the heck? Wardrobe will clear it up later. Uh, right. Uh, well, to, to raise uh, more money, we've got. I've got the leader of the Swaffham Fiverside Squad. Your name is uh, Jim Corns. Jim what? Jim Corns. Corns? Corns, C A U N C E. Corns. Oh, right, Is that a joke name? No. No. Right. And where are you from? Uh, Kings Lynn. Kings Lynn? I've got a friend in Kings Lynn. So now, t so tell me, you, what, you have another cunning plan to raise money for Comic Relief. How are you going to do that? That's right, Alan. Well, me and the lads, um, we have pledged £500 if you'll show your bottom on live television. Yeah. Yeah. I don't think I like the sound, the sound of that at all. <laughs> But, um, oh, I, all right, then, I will show my bottom. Hooray! Hooray! Oh, it's, it's, a, it's a plastic bottom. A plastic Boom! So, 500 pounds to come. Where's oh, your ass? I don't think that's good enough, really. Do we? No, no. That, well, I don't care. No, that's not real. what we rehearsed. No, we'd like to see the real well, thing. Well, you can, we we can forget about that. No. Oh, they're going to jump you. Oh, God, God they're jumping no, you. No, 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 please don't. Not my ass. Not my ass. Please, no. Oh. Oh, they pied him in the ass. That's all from current relief. <laughs> Back to the studio. Jesus. But, um. Hi, I'm Alan Partridge. Join me live in pie. Norwich for Comic Relief with Alan Partridge. Oh, he's like the DVD extra. Relief in the Norwich area. Well, it's not bad. I mean, if, if you've if you've got if you can come up stump up the cash. They'll, you know, and it's it's easy money. You know, why don't you do it? You know, that's that's the, um, and it's. Uh, <laughs> he said that, <laughs> marvelous, yeah. The, if these can these, can we can we secure this? Because it's not. I'm not. I'm not I don't think it's going to stay up in the wind. Yeah, it'll be fine. No. Actually, kind of surprised didn't tip over. Just leave it over there. Leave it there. Leave it there. Leave it. Leave it. <sighs> Tell you what, I, had, I got really fucking worried when they pinned him up against a tree like that. <laughs> you ever seen American History X? <laughs> I got really worried. <laughs> oh, man. Jesus. Well, uh, again, the upscale, like, again, shout out to Couch Tipper. I'll, again, I'll link that in his, his channel in the description, but um, the upscale looked great. Um, but that was a fun little segment. Fucking, uh, I mean, he's got a point, though. You know, those people got, like, all that free advertising and they're donating 75 pounds. He's, I mean, usually he's just a dick just to be a dick, but I mean... He's got point, you know. If you're getting, you're you get what was it, twenty five hundred pounds in free advertising? That they're getting, and they, but they gave back seventy five. I mean, I I don't know. I don't think he's necessarily just being a dick to be a dick. There, I think he had a point. I think he had a point there. Um, but that was the last of three um Alan Partridge things we've done this month. Uh, we're gonna finish um. I'm Alan Partridge next month, so that'll be fun. But that is it for me today. Thank you guys for watching. If you liked the video, be sure to leave a like. If you didn't like it, don't. If you want to follow any of my social media links, they're all in the video description down below, as well as names on my Patreon. If you didn't know, you can be a patron on me for, me for as low as $1 or £1, pound, and you get access to direction videos, as well as reading comments up to, up to a day early, uh, sometimes more. For all that being said, though, my name is Taffer. This has been my reaction to Alan Partridge on Comic Relief in 1995, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.